The San Antonio Zoo is enjoying the same economic growth as the city. More than one million people visited the zoo in 2017, and it generated nearly $33 million in revenue. The zoo has seen substantial revenue from new and improved food offerings, and nearly half of last year's visitors were from other markets. A couple of major highway closures this weekend. Both north and southbound lanes of I-35 near Shirts will close at 9 p.m. Saturday until 3 p.m. Sunday, so crews can remove the FM 1103 bridge. On the northwest side, eastbound lanes of I-10 between Bernie Stage and Camp Bullis will close tomorrow for construction. Our business news update now with Tony Casada from the San Antonio Business Journal. Thanks, Sherry. Jungle Disc, a downtown-based cybersecurity company, has launched an internship program for high school students and recent graduates in partnership with San Antonio ISD and other educational and workforce development organizations. The program entails having 21 interns study Jungle Disc products as part of four teams and present their research at the end of the internship. Jungle Disc CEO Brett Pyatt said the company is thrilled to play a part in sparking interest in technology among high school students. The United Way of San Antonio and Bear County has named Christopher Martin to be its next president and CEO. Martin, who is Chief Development Officer for United Way of Greater Cincinnati and has nearly three decades of experience in the United Way Network, will replace Lyndon Herridge, who plans to retire next spring. Thanks, Tony. Find all these stories online at klrn.org news.